Hey guys, Colton Tacker here on Sonic and OK Care for 2020 here, bringing to you part 12 of my Let's Play of, oh wait, no, that's not a Let's Play, I forgot. Part 12 of the 2020 edition of the walkthrough of the Dell Dimension 4600, and um, yeah, 2020 edition of the Windows XP Home Edition running on Dell Dimension 4600, so um, so um, the last part we did uh, yeah, we're going to wait for the welcome screen to show up, but anyway, um, I think it's showing up now. Anyway, in the last part, we played Minesweeper, Pinball, and Spider Solitaire, of course. Alright, we're logging on now. So, um, so, um, you know how pretty cool this is? So, um, you know, in this video, I think we're going to eventually, like, uh, do something different this time, and that is like record audio from something, some player to a computer. So, um, we're gonna use Audacity for this example. So, um, let's wait for the okay, the my documents folder is opened, and um, and um, Audacity. We get Audacity, the Audacity file, we're going to open it. <clears throat> it's going to open any second now. And of course, we're going to need to get my, my record player. We have to bring it downstairs today, so that way we can try to record the audio from it. So, um, we're going to eventually do that. So, viewers, I'll be right back after I get the record player. Oh, oh gosh, okay. Alright, so I'm back now. I got the record player taken downstairs, so that way I can eventually, like, try to do something about recording from a record to the computer for this video so um so here's the record player right here and there's this this blue cable that's my my audio and in input i connected the input to the computer so that way i can record the audio from the record player to the computer i know i've done this for like i think possibly like uh Oh, sorry if my fingers got into the camera, but it, it happens. I'm sorry. So, um, I think I've done it like this for, like, probably, like, about two years now. Since I now know how to eventually, like, plug in audio input from a player to a computer. It's, like, that easy. It's pretty easy. So, we're going to turn on the player. Let's go do that. And, um, I'm going to need a 45 RPM to show you, so... I'll be right back after I get a 45 RPM record. Okay, I've now got a 45 RPM record. I brought it downstairs so that way I could like try to put the put it on the player. So this is a 45 RPM I got from Discogs as a bonus from the, you know that B52's Love Shack 45 45 RPM I got. This one was one of the bonuses. So um, this is on Avco 45 RPM 45 RPM record. With Gordon Sinclair, the Americans, a Canadian's opinion, and the flip side for this is a profile of Gordon Sinclair. So um, so we're gonna, I I can't hold my phone and try to put the record in at the same time. So I'm gonna eventually like try to put the record in the player, and I got it in. So um, need to get this record taken. So. I turn auto stop off so that way um, I can eventually like. All right, so um, I need to get the record in place. I need to start off with the profile of Gordon Sinclair first. So viewers, I'll be right back. All right, so I got the flip side in. You know the, the profile of Gordon Sinclair side of the record. So I try to test it out first. No. You have just heard All right, so it's playing. Um, you hear it on the speakers. Of the so, yep, um, I'm going to record the playback of it. So, um, let's just do that. You have just heard, or you are just about to hear on the other side of this recording, some words in praise of the Americans. They are written and spoken by a man who is also an American, in the sense that he is a resident of North America. But since he is not a citizen of the United States, perhaps in your eyes he is a non-American, a foreigner, in fact, a Canadian. He is my friend and colleague, Gordon Sinclair. 
is a news commentator on radio station CFRB in Toronto, Ontario, Canada. He speaks to the second largest audience on that station, the most listened to radio station in our country. He is an opinionated original thinker. There is no subject too delicate for his comment. There is no man nor institution in the world he is afraid to tackle. His language is simple and down to earth. At times he is shocking, crass and vulgar. He has used language which has expanded the frontiers of accepted usage. He lectures politicians and punctures inflated egos. He defies laws which he considers unjust or stupid. He is known nationally in Canada as a television performer, but he is first and foremost a news commentator. He is an old man now, but he has memories which reach back to the days when he was footloose in India and China and a score of the exotic lands of this earth as a foreign correspondent. He is fiercely proud to be a Canadian. He has often commented critically about individual citizens of the United States and the actions of its government. But he has a long memory for good deeds, as one day in June 1973, pondering the story of a disaster in the United States, thinking of the troubles which have beset the people of America, he became indignant. Indignant that other men and other nations have forgotten the long and honorable path the United States has pursued to this moment in time. And he turned to his microphone and he recalled for his own countrymen the saga of modern America. He told it as a Canadian, the foreigner whose country has been critic, customer, supplier, friend and ally of the United States since the War of 1812. As the result, in the words of Gordon Sinclair, was the Americans. All right, so that's that's the profile of Sinclair for you now. There is some noise on the 40 power PM I'm going to have to get rid of, so, so I'm going to have to show you an example, so... Yo, let's take a listen right here. Commentator. He's Hear that? Man. That is the noise on it. Tater. He's I got rid I'm gonna get rid of this, so I'm, I'm probably gonna make it silent, so I have to find a way to make it silent, so how do you Okay, there's silence right here. And there we go. Now let's take a listen. Who's commentator? He is an old man now, but he has mem. Commentator. He is an old man now. Let me just try to. I hope I could do it. You know, what? give me a second, guys. I'm gonna need to eventually like try to do this. Sorry about that. I can't even like try to get rid of the silence. You know, because I cannot even get rid of the. Of the Americans, they are rich of the Americans. They are written. Americans. They are written. Yeah, I, I don't know. I, I'm probably going to need to deal with it. I, I can't I can't fix it. Like, there is some noise on this record. I'm. It's hard to get rid of it. And I, I don't really know how to fix it. I mean, I've been trying to use a noise re reduction, but I can hear, like, weird noises in silent parts. Like, I, you know what? Let's just try to eventually, like... I mean, I'm going to be saving it, but, uh, so, um, yeah, and, um, all right, so I'm saving it to my thumb drive now, so go click OK, and, um, now we're going to need to put in the other side, which is, you know, the original 45 RPM side, which is on the Gordon Sinclair speech, the Americans and Canadians opinion. So, I might as well have to do that, so... But, you know, I'm probably, I'll am probably i have to continue recording after I record the playback from that side of the 44 p.m. So, I'll be right back after I do that. Also, I like my shirt. It's an OKKO OK shirt. It's available on Redbubble, and you can get it anytime you want. So, yeah. Okay, so... I took care of it. I, I recorded the audio for the 44 p.m. of... The Americans, Canadians Opinion by Gordon Sinclair. I recorded it to the computer. I exported the audio and it looks like we all got it now. It looks like I got it. I got the whole thing now. So, I mean, there is some noise in the profile of Gordon Sinclair side of the record because I, I was messing around with that. I don't know why I did that. I mean, it's not broken or anything, but it, I don't, I would never ever break a record. Like, it's not a good idea to do it anyway. So, um, so anyway, um, and there we go. That's. Let's take a listen to some of the playback of that, the audio for it. Let's take a listen. 
Hear that? Sounds pretty cool, doesn't it? United States dollar. Yep. Got it all taken care of. So now, um... Yeah, that's going to be on my Sonic and OK Care for next... Uh, yeah. Well, you know... The, you know, the audio for this 45 RPM, this audio is going to be on my Sonic and OK Kid for Next 2020 Records channel. While this video I'm making is going to be on the actual channel, Sonic and OK Kid for Next 2020. So, yeah, um, I might have to take a picture of this 45 RPM just so I can show you all. So, um, I'll be right back after I take the pictures. Alright, so I took the pictures and now we're going to bring this back up to my room now. Um, so yeah, that's going to conclude part 12 of the 2020 edition of the walkthrough of the Dell Dimension 4600 running Windows XP Home Edition. Now, um, I'm not going to shut down the computer for this part because I might have to record another, I have to record more audio from records. So, um, viewers, I'm going to be, I'm going to, I'm going to continue on, but I'm going to end this part here. Um, I don't know if the next part's going to be on like me playing Super Collapse 3, but we'll have to see. I don't, we'll have to see. It might depend. But um, anyway, viewers, I'll see you guys in the next part. This is Quentin Tackett on Sonic and OKKO OK for next 2020 signing off. See you in the next part, and peace out.